Hello and welcome to Unism. Our topic for today's presentation is African Spiritual Vision, the African Testament of God. The African Spiritual Vision is to share African spiritual values with the rest of the world, and it starts by writing the African Testament of God. The writing of the African Testament of God has been delayed for centuries, and this delay has resulted in the enslavement of Africans for centuries. There is no better time to write the African Testament of God than now that many young people are committed to the liberation of Africa. You may ask why we need an African Testament of God when we already have the Bible, the Quran, the Bhagavad Gita, the Tao Te Ching, and so on. Great question, and the simplest answer is that all these books are foreign sacred texts. Foreign sacred texts do not belong in Africa. Further, some of these texts promote exclusivity, fanaticism, fundamentalism, chosen people, cruelty, and violence. Africans have a golden opportunity to write a sacred text that highlights the sins of the world like slavery, colonization, and other evils committed by humans for future generations, but at the same time to promote universal love, compassion, and interdependence. What is at stake is your freedom. What is at stake are your experiences. What is at stake are your contributions. What is at stake is the joy and happiness of your children. How can you really move forward if the very foundation of your existence is controlled by foreigners? Wake up from your hypnosis and take charge of your destiny. The slavery of the mind is the greatest threat to the advancement of the African. You are not created to believe, instead you are created to know. You are not created to expect saviors to save you, instead you are created to experience life in all its forms. You are not created to worship foreign gods, instead you are created to enrich the world with your own experiences. You are not created to believe in foreign sacred texts. Instead, you are created to share your sacred experiences. Africa's spiritual foundation based on the Bible, the Quran, or both? No, because both texts are foreign texts. Foreign sacred texts can never be the basis for Africa's spiritual foundation. Until Africa adopts an African spiritual foundation, Africa will always be a slave to alien thoughts, and moving forward will always be very difficult if not impossible, Africa can never move forward with a foreign spiritual foundation. During his lecture at Osun State University in Nigeria, Osman Torres said, We feel happy to be with brands that are Western and of Western values than our own. So we are happy to read from the Bible and the Quran because they are foreign. The question is, who is at a loss? when we sponsor foreign brands and values. Have you ever thought about who benefits each time we buy a foreign sacred text? Have you considered whose ancestors are elevated each time you read from a foreign sacred text? Have you reflected on who is enriched each time you go on pilgrimage to a foreign land? Are the contributions of your ancestors really important to you? If they are, this is the time to act. Your life has been controlled by foreign ideas for centuries. These ideas have kept you in one place because you believed in the way things are to be the truth. Nothing could be further from the truth because we live in a changing universe and you can change what people have put in place. This change begins by first writing the African Testament of God. The African Testament of God is your sacred text and it contains your experiences in this world to show the way to your descendants. This is a call to make this text a reality for Africans and the world. The African Testament of God contains not only your contributions, successes and sufferings, but also the miraculous moments during your sufferings. Think about the opportunities that are in store for you and the freedom that it will bestow upon you. You are no longer controlled by the foreign ideas that we have forced on you. Write the African Testament of God and change your destiny. Write the African Testament of God for the unity of Africa, the elevation of your 
ancestors, the joy of your children, and the education of the world. It is your turn to be king. I may have been conquered, demonized, dehumanized, exploited, deceived, raped, tortured, humiliated, enslaved, colonized, lynched, mutilated, and murdered. But I'm not bitter. Instead, I have evolved. Testaments of God. Please check us out at unison.org for awakened living study, life cycle ceremonies, and human development studies and practices. And subscribe to our channel and receive educational and entertaining weekly videos on the human condition, human development, and human potential. Today's favorite quote is, I may have been conquered, demonized, dehumanized, exploited, deceived, raped, tortured, humiliated, enslaved, colonized, lynched, mutilated, and murdered. But I am not bitter. Instead, I have evolved. Think about it, and thank you for watching.